Hello everyone and welcome to episode 63 of the Fort Invaders playthrough. We're here in the Mormon Fort in the free side. I'm going to talk to Lily to try and complete her quest. Although I really don't know what to do with her. Hello again dear. Oh that old thing. That's just a home take from the last time I visited my grandkids. Such sweet little children, you know, little angels. Sometimes it's hard to remember them. So I take that old tape out from time to time and listen. It's my medicine, dearie. It keeps me calm, but it makes my memory go all fuzzy. That's why I only take my dosage every other time. That way, at least I remember their faces. Oh, don't you worry your silly little head about that pumpkin. Grandma knows what she's doing. Oh, this is... What decision? Make it go insane. Uh... Don't go insane, but you forget your family, or just stay the same. Hmm. So, I just took a while to full think about it, and I honestly think the middle one, middle option, is the best. Although this one, every other time, yeah. Because I mean, this one, <laughs> you remember your past, but you, you, you just, <laughs> yeah, you lose. I don't know, you, you remember your past, but you don't mental. Uh, this one is, you forget your past, and you don't, you, you don't, you're not mental, but you forget who you are. And then this one is, you get a bit of both, but you're still fucked. Oh, this is such a, this is such a hard quest. Such a hard decision. Oh, I'm gonna have to do this one. That's sweet of you, dearie. I'll try to be better about controlling myself if I see you try to sneak away. All right, pumpkin. There you go. I don't know how. Not sure how I feel about it, but I think that's, that's probably the option I'd take. Why? Right. Dead bunny. Or what other? Companions, do we not have? We've got him. We've got Lily. We've got Rex. We did. We did Rex. We did it, Eddie. But request is like in a few days. So we've done Arcade. We've done Lily. We've done Rex. We've done Eddie. We've done. Did we do Veronica? Did we do Veronica? Did we do Veronica? I don't actually remember doing Veronica. She's at the 108 training post, isn't she? Let's, have, let's take, a, take a wander over there and see if she's there. Your okay, uh, we crashed a bit there, <laughs> if you noticed. But anyway, right, I don't think we've done Veronica's quest, so I'm going to have to dismiss Lily, sadly. Uh, where's the button? Does it have to talk to? Hi. Can I... That's it. Yawn. Nice children shouldn't play in places like that, dearie. That's the sort of place Leah. Right, there goes the fashion into the ether. Hello, Veronica Santiago. Hey. Is that her name? Nice. No offense, Remember, but maybe. you look like you've traveled a long way down some bad roads. Where'd you come from? Yeah, the grave. Huh. Well, in that case, I take it back. You look pretty good, given the circumstances. Well, welcome then. I'm Veronica. I live in a hole in the ground. I can't actually believe I've missed Veronica. I haven't done Veronica. I've done the Veronica quest. I can't believe it. Because I always, in all of my playthroughs, I come past here and get Veronica as the first companion. I never skip her. What did I do back then? Unless this is like a save the... Uh, I swear I must have. Never mind. Let's go. Well, a bunker, if you want to get technical. Also, I, think it sounds I feel like the music's gone way. back to normal. But I'm not there much anymore. My, 100% change this. 100%. Yay, 
Yeah, I'm not worried. They can handle themselves. But somebody has to get the groceries, know what I mean? And actually these days, I think they'd rather have me out here anyway. But that's a whole other story. So listen, can I ask you something on the level? I had a run-in with this group calling themselves the Brotherhood of Steel. Pretty strange bunch. Do you know anything about them? <laughs> Should I say that? It's probably the. That's that would surprise her. My intelligence, though. Ah, oh, fuck it. And? Uh. I'm reserving judgment. That seems wise. I think I am, too. Although, for how much longer? I'm not sure. Hey, so. Where are you headed, anyway? Wasn't really gonna say the bottom one. I didn't want to make her angry. <laughs> huh? Just on your way to do a little heavily fortified sightseeing. Kind of a thrill seeker, aren't you? I'll be honest. You're the first person I've run across out here that looks like he can really handle himself. Oh yeah, there baby. There are places I've never been to that'd be too dangerous for just me. What do you think? Maybe we could travel together. Help now you're talking. One thing you should know first, though. I ask you about the Brotherhood because I'm one of them. I know, I know, but I had to know how you react when I told you. We have made a lot of enemies. You still okay bringing me along? You haven't made that many enemies on the East Coast, if I'm honest. <laughs> That's like two. Two day at full at four and full at three it would just have you as the good guys. A bit dumb though, but whatever. I'm great at punching people. I'm not gonna lie. It's a gift. Well, thanks for taking a chance on a naive young girl from California with stars in her eyes and a pneumatic gauntlet on her hand. Let's hit the road, huh? I love the writing in this game. The writing in this game is great. Super sad that the Super sad that the developers didn't get their bonus, but then I saw that. Nelson will serve as <laughs> right, now we go to Hidden Valley, so somehow we already have this quest. What rangefinder? What rangefinder? <laughs> Do I have it on me? Is that is that why? Because I have it on me. Is it a mist? Don't remember. It's been like a year since I last played. So I, I, you know, I don't, I have no idea. <laughs> We're in the rain trying to, I don't have a bloody rain trying to, do I? Ah, oh, let's go have a look. Quest says go there, I'll go there. This is the door over here. Be happy to see me, and maybe Veronica as well, who knows. It's pretty dark. Maybe I should talk to her first. I've got to say, it's been a long time since I've done this quest. Or any quest in Fallout in Vegas. What do you think of Mr. House? I was surprised he only had the two robot sex slaves. I like long walks in the dead. I would say he was my tutor, but that doesn't cover it. After my parents passed, he looked after me. The whole brotherhood brought me up, really, but... He made sure of it. I never had a grandfather, not that I knew, anyway. But Elijah was in some ways what I'd imagined a grandfather to be. It was by his request, actually. He cleared it with the other elders. Somehow. They sent him to look into the dam. There was a time when I'd have begged to follow. Watch him at work. He did. For years, he fought with the council. Taught me to question our direction. Meanwhile, he'd become more out of touch than all of them. On our way east, he demanded we stop at Helios 1 to examine it. While we were there, we received word that the NCR had taken the dam. He was furious. Called it children playing with a bomb, but he was mad because we'd lost his power. What we'd use it for? He didn't even care. They're cautious. When they discover something, they respect it, learn its limits, consider how to preserve it. Used to drive Father Elijah crazy. 
He liked to learn limits too, but only so he could push them. That's not to excuse the other elders, though. They all covet technology for its own sake. Some are just more fanatical than others. Yeah, I did. I couldn't help him. He just didn't listen. And the idea that people talk back to him... <sighs> if he could have made the Brotherhood act like machines, ordering them around with the push of a button, he would have. I don't know. Last time anyone saw him was in the battle at Helios 1. I wasn't there. He gave orders to hold the plant until he could be reactivated. But he ran out of time. The NCR overran it. Everyone thought he was dead. But I got a note from him at a comm station. That's how he liked to talk, even to me. He wasn't good at face-to-face. -face. It was... strange. Even for Father Elijah. He's always been unstable, but this was... something else. I don't want to say delusional, but I don't know what else to call it. The only thing familiar about it was the signature. He said the Brotherhood was doomed, but that he'd return, save us. But the way he said it... I don't know. Said he'd return with one of the greatest treasures of the old world. Make the Mojave like it was meant to be. Wipe the slate clean. Wipe the slate clean? Oh, What, you mean kill everyone? Kill everyone in the Mojave, probably. That's what that means. A nuclear bomb! Boom! Kaboom. Let. Right, never mind. Shouldn't, shouldn't have anything to say about walking into her house. I do like the look of this bunker. It's, it's like the Enclave bunker. I like the look of all the Enclave shit. Also, I like your... What looks like a uh, Russian World War II gun, which is actually a plasma rifle. Where? Is, it, is this you? Oh, come on. What I wish to discuss with you can wait for once I get settled in the command room, outsider. Move then! Stop looking at that bloody wall! Oh my god. Do I have to wait? Come on, is this a bug? Please. Right, let's go to the command room then and just wait there. Where is the command room? I see. Right, let's wait for this guy in the command room. I realise I look just like the bloody enclave, but wh whatever. <laughs> I'm the new elder now. I can't wait here. I'm sitting down. Come on, is he bugged? He has to be bugged. What's this? So that's Nellis Air Force Base, and we got Lucky 38, Camp McCarran, Hoover Dam, Black Mountain, and then uh, the Repton Test Site. Well, I don't know what this fin's doing. It's just going to different locations randomly. That's Jacob's down, probably. That's, that's the Vault 22. That's where we are. I think. Why does it, why does it do this? This must be like an Easter egg fin. Come on, where's the bloody Elder? He's not here. Oh, God, is it... It's bad, isn't it? Level 1. Bunker level 1. Oh, what a surprise! You're saying it's seen here. What I wish to discuss with you, you can wait. What I, 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 what I wish to discuss with you can wait for once I get settled in the command room outsider. My God. Move! Move your ass to the control! What I just I want to speak to you to finish this bloody quest! Settled in the command room outsider. Nice. Should have brought something. Aw. Okay, we're here at Camp McCarran. Got right with me. We're gonna try and do a quest. There's three triggers that trigger dialogue. I think I remember. Now, I'm not gonna look it up. I'm just gonna of what I remember. So Camp McCarran is one of them. I think Cottonwood Cove is another and I think Vault 3 is another. I think there's like two others but I, you know I can't be bothered. I don't, I don't want to go look because the alt tab might crash the game. <laughs> also you can see through the ground over there I just realised. I don't think I think there's a special door you go through this one. The middle door I think is correct. 
Okay, it just crashed, so uh, <laughs> here we go again. Okay, you know what I just realised? I can't go in there because it crashes the game every time I go in there. Fuck! Why? That sun is so loud. So loud, so ginormous and bright. And... Oh, got it. Right. What else do we do? Where else does this quest? I think Cottonwood Cove does this quest, so let's go there. Ordinary right. guys Cottonwood with knives Cove. and bullets, nice. and they're taking over Nevada. You can't help but notice that the Brotherhood barely exists to these people out here. We're like an urban myth, no real presence on the outside. We just don't adapt like we should. Used to be that all you needed to get your way was a suit of power armor and a laser rifle. Now, people are armed and organized. They're not afraid. But we still stick to our old approach because it's all we know. Yeah, but only if you've got bodies to fill the suits. We don't take on new members. We're all descendants from the original Brotherhood. Something's oh, gonna have the to incest. change, or the empty suits are gonna be all that's left of us. Right, one trigger out of three. Where can we go for the rest? Vault three? Uh oh. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, I have got this. Why have I got this out? Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. Uh, yeah. That didn't really fuck anyone up, but whatever. Oh, we're ready, back. That's good. Doesn't exactly feel like the uh, the 725 from uh, <laughs> on warfare. I mean, I'd one shot him from this way if it was a 725 from that game. We can use them to uh, repair our other guns. Oh god, what there? Oh, the modern warfare is paying off. Anything? No? Should have brought something. Aw. Hope you're picking the winning side here. Be nice to fight. No. Oh shit, hello, there's still more. I thought I'd turn this off. Yes, okay, I I know, I can see! Stop! No power armor, no energy weapons, and they're giving the NCR more oh, she trouble got the, than she we got ever the trigger. did. She got the trigger, mm. right. Should have brought some- Aw. Oh. You know, I've been thinking. The real problem with the Brotherhood is that we isolate ourselves. Our training is top-notch, our technology gives us an advantage. But when it all comes down to it, we're losing because we shun the outside world. We always make enemies, never allies. We refuse to recruit outsiders or see the value in their simpler technologies. I don't know. I'm still thinking about what kind of role we could take on that would give us the best chance of survival. But I think things are starting to come together. I know the odds aren't good, but I gotta try. I can't lose them. Right, I'm gonna go look up where we need to go next because I can't remember. If we can't go to McCarran, because it crashes all the time, then I don't know where to go. So I'll have a look up. Right, we're here at the Nellis Air Force Base. We're gonna go to the museum because we need to talk to them about it. Now I had a look online, and if we don't, since we're so far into the story and we've completed a lot of quests, we sort of fucked ourselves because. A lot of those quests require Veronica to be... When, when Veronica's a follower, a lot of those quest lines trigger the dialogue that we're trying to get. Now, since I've already done those quests, I can't hear those quest lines, those dialogue lines anymore. So, uh... <laughs> I can't trigger the quests. Okay, I crashed every time I walk up to the Hannahs. So I'm gonna <laughs> teleport to the Hannahs. Oh, I'm gonna be so happy when I don't have to record this game anymore. I think I know why I haven't recorded it in ages. It's because it crashes all the time. Now, there was a memory leak on this game a long time ago where it would just 
progressively get worse and worse performance the more you play. I'm pretty sure that's still a thing. So the more and more we play, the more and more it's fucked. So whenever we go to Hoover Dam and have that big fight, it's going to crash a ton. Right, museum. Cross your fingers, everyone. That's oh, Laura's house. Next. Next. Oh, we found it. It's good. Now, is there anyone here? Oh, it's a child. What? Who are you? You're the outsider. Mother Pearl sent word that you'd be stopping by. You must be eager to hear the story of our people. Not really, I just want the tr quest to trigger. Wonderful. I'm sure you've noticed the mirror on the wall of this hut. Shall I tell you what it all means? Excellent. Imagine you're the first outsider to ever hear our tale. <clears throat> I, won't, I won't spoil the end of this, this mural. Ages ago, long before I was born, we lived underground. Everyone had guns, but the overseer wouldn't let us explode anything. Not even a hand grenade. We left and wandered the wastes. They were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades. Burned them with flamethrowers. It was neat, but there was a downside. For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost one of our own. We needed a new home. We needed Nellis. Here we have prospered and multiplied. Here our mighty guns destroy any savages who might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Well, until... But... Not saying you want to harm us or you're a savage, but anyways. Nellis has revealed many secrets. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once based here, and it has taught us where to find one. And that is our story so far. For this last image is our future. To restore the bomber, to fly the open skies in armored safety, running high explosive ordnance upon ignorant savages. This is our destiny. I'm well, pleased that you listened to the entire story. Good old B17. Perhaps there are details you'd like to know more about. Let me know. Did you did you did you get that? Yes? Veronica, please say something to me. A bunch of shut-ins oh, use foreign outsiders fuck. and hold technology over them. Gee, where have I heard that one before? Hey, you got a second? The Brotherhood is failing. I've always known that. If we don't change course, we're going to fall apart or fade away. But until recently, I haven't understood where we went wrong or how to fix it. I think I need to go home. Great! Thanks! Thank you! I'll encourage people to name their non-ugly children after you. Seriously. Right. To the bunker! What does he know? We crashed. Anyway, uh... Whoa. Uh, okay. I didn't know that was there. Quit save. Just in case we crash. Again. For the 20th time today. It really does take it out of me recording this. So if you are watching, make sure you hit that like button. We crashed it in, by the way. Oh, God. When I do a Fallout 4 playthrough, I hope it's not like this. <laughs> to be honest, I haven't crashed that many times before. And in front of Vegas, I've crashed more times than I think is possible. I don't know where I'm going with this sentence. Right, please say he's moved. He hasn't moved. He's just still sat, fucking sat here. Come on! Once I get Why settled, is this, this so fucked? Ah, oh, that fits it, hopefully. Come on. Move. He's gone. Right, that's good. We fixed it. Ah, oh, here's the elder. Let's talk. What the fuck now? Is she talking to him? Go. Talk. What? I... 
What are we doing here? What's up? Why is one with this game? I think I might not have issued it. I think because I'm in, I came here on my own, and this quest is bud because she's trying to talk to him, and he is trying to talk to me, but I can't talk to him because I'm on doing one quest, one quest, and she's doing another quest. So he's in the middle of two quests, and he can't choose what dialogue option to pick. When you first showed up on well, our doorstep, not. I'll admit at first I didn't know what Give to up think. this game. After giving the matter some thought, however. I've decided that an outsider could be of great use to me right now. However, I will not force you to help us. Should you refuse, you will be allowed to leave here. Though no, we will be keeping an eye on you. What do you say, outsider? Are you willing to help us? Then allow me to explain our situation. This bunker is currently locked down, allowing no entry or exit with you being one of the few exceptions. In exceptional cases, teams are sent out to investigate sites or retrieve materials deemed too important to ignore. Three such teams have gone missing recently, and the news of their disappearance has not yet been widely spread to avoid undue concern. In order to maintain the peace and adhere to the strictures of the lockdown, I need to send someone else to discover what happened to them. While that is disheartening news, there remains hope that the other two patrols may still be found alive. I doubt it, but okay. I'm glad I can count on you. Oh, and one other thing. The patrols each had a holotape detailing their missions that you can use to track them. The shielding of the bunker prevents us from actively tracking them, but their positions should show up on your map once you get to the surface. Should our worst fears become realized, please bring back all three of the holotapes from the patrols. Otherwise, bring our brothers home. I've given the order that you be given access to some of the equipment our scouts and patrols have scavenged over the years. You won't be allowed to purchase any prohibited equipment, but hopefully some of what's available will prove useful to you. Right, Veronica, go. I've been to the Repton HQ. Oh, okay, there we go, done. Nennis Air Force Base. Oh. Oh fuck! Black Mountain. Oh fuck! Found the missing patrols, or the fuck? Come on! Why can't you do Voyager's quest? Uh... Found the missing patrols. Or... What's up? Tighter that's been given leave to wander around freely. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I guess. Name's Harden. I'm the head paladin of this chapter, and I think we might be able to help each other out. I don't know what the Elder talked to you about, but I can tell you this chapter is in trouble, and he's at the center of it. Are you willing to listen to what I have to say? As you may have already heard, this entire base is under a state of lockdown. No one goes out except small patrols at night. Most of the chapter has been sealed in here for years. And those few who are outside when the lockdown was initiated are forbidden from returning. Morale has plummeted as time has gone by. And many of our current paladins haven't seen combat outside of training simulations. And all because of the Elder's explicit order that no one be allowed in or out. The only way things will change is if a new Elder is installed. Veronica's a special case. She handles the procurement of supplies. If we didn't let her and those like her back in, we'd all starve. If the Elder could manage it, he'd shut them out as well, and all in the name of security, which is why we need to replace him. I don't know. I've gone through our records dozens of times looking for a precedent regarding the dismissal of an Elder and come up with nothing. The people who are most likely to know how it could be done are also some of McNamara's strongest supporters, so they refuse to help me, which is why we're having this conversation. An outsider such as yourself would arouse less suspicion asking questions about such matters. The fact that the Elder has some tasks for you means his faithful won't suspect you, and you have a line open to the man himself. In short, you're in a perfect position to help me. Will you at least think about it? That'll have to do. I'd recommend going to see Ramos first. As head of security, he's more familiar with our protocols than anyone else here. 
You could also try to find something relevant in our data store, though last I heard Scribe Ibsen is having a bit of a problem accessing it. And if McNamara should give you any tasks, I'd ask that you kept me abreast of them. Report anything you find to me, and we'll move from there. Right, well, that's that. Right, we're straight out of the, of the bunker. We don't know, straight up here to the Black Mountain. You know, we haven't discovered it yet, and there's uh, enemies on the way. Also, I've just realised how much ammo I've got. Oh my god, this thing's bright as fuck. Scared the life out of me. Let's head up here towards Black Mountain Radio. Is that a Bart Scorpion? Or. No, that's a bloody centaur. An evolved centaur. Oh! Ah! He's saying poo! Oh, there's more. Loads. Oh, there's one here. <laughs> Good game, Ryan. Did you punch the shit out of him? I wasn't even hitting him. Oh, this guy is fucked. Let's just take some of his blood. Oh, well, there's more. Go for the quit save. Oh, there's a fucking another one as well. This is a crater. What have I, what have I got a lot of ammo for? Who's that? Yes, 100%. Nice. I think I've found the uh, Brotherhood Patrol as well. In this crater here. It's such a huge crater. Take everything off them. And uh, I'm not sure why it's a huge crater here. I can't get out of the bloody crater though. They must have done the self-destruct on their um, armour. Something over there as well, I'm not sure where it is. Where's the, have I got the Gobi campaign sniper rifle? I do indeed. What is it? Is that like a dead bison? Maybe. Let me take some red away while I'm here. Still being radiated. Right, what else is next? We got that one. Go back there, and then this one is... Oh, fuck! I think I don't know how they died. Okay, we're here at... Nearest Air Force Base. We did crash loads in here, but whatever. Now, there should be over this hill somewhere. Hopefully we don't get shot by the boomers. They're in a house, dead. Probably. Probably some... Interesting loot around here as well. Oh, hello, I think I found them. Need to repair some armour. Right, uh, we got it all. Is it back to. Do you want to listen to this mission statement? And to dare to do it. Uh, escort, military base northeast. Components we need. F territorial. They have any <laughs> Hardly unlikely they have any weapons that can seriously threaten someone in full power armor. Threat level minimal. What's a retard? Ah, <laughs> uh, what's this? What's this? What's the Battle of Valor? Hughes and Fairbanks. 
head north the nearby two mutations away look for components mentioned in the briefing means they have been reasonable in the past maybe sort of helpful They've been reasonable in the past but they weren't though how the f I can't believe you. <laughs> the guy has really bad uh, knowledge oh it's the um um okay <laughs> That was fucking hilarious. Oh, there's a, a patrol leaving the base. They're gonna go wander around, are they? Hello. That one has a weirdly coloured helmet. Okay, we haven't crashed, which is good. Let's go. Talk to the elder. We've done this quest for him. This is gonna be a long episode. Just, I don't know why I'm warning you now, because it's coming to the end of it. But anyway, we're back. All right, let's have a look. Talk to this elder. Oh god, I can't talk to him. Found the missing oh, it patrols, Holy or shit. was something else on your mind? They were all dead then. I suppose I'm not surprised. We have few friends in the world above, and many enemies. But we must turn our minds to other matters. When I sent out those patrols, I also sent three knights out on scouting missions. When the patrols failed to return, we assumed the worst, and sent a single communication to the scouts to hold position and maintain radio silence. I want you to contact those scouts and gather their reports. Like the patrols, they have devices on them that will enable you to track them. When you find them, tell them you're my representative and ask them if the bears are still hunting. That should get them to talk to you. Return when you've gathered all of their reports. I just want to talk, wanted to talk to you. Right, I don't know how long this episode is going to be, but thanks for watching. Uh, we'll be back in episode 63 when I hopefully iron out this bug. And, uh, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, like the video, subscribe. Thanks for watching.